Hey Micro Machine fans and collectors, I'm coming at you today with a video of the brand new 2020 Micro Machines. And we got here the number one farm set. This is the first set, um, according to the list of them, this is number one of the starter pack set. And um, first we're going to take a look at this tractor here. This tractor's pretty awesome. Looks like eventually we might be getting trailers. We got a hitch right here. Um, really cool tractor. I know at the Toy Fair, I saw there was a blue one of these. Uh, we might be getting the blue one with the Super Van City when we get it. Really cool rims. I like the rim choice for the tractor. Don't know why people don't like the new wheels. I actually really like them. Number 14. These cars have numbers on the bottom of them. Then we got the farm truck here. It says Micro Farms 86, which I believe is when the first original Micros actually came out. Got nice taillight details. It's even got that little split window in the middle. That's pretty cool. You can really see the headlight details on this guy. Oh yeah, that's really cool. Sorry about that. A stupid alarm went off in the background. But, um, yeah, this thing is really cool. What I wish they would have done is they would have given every car in this pack these wheels. These wheels look amazing on this truck because I actually bought two of them and I did a wheel swap. So, yeah, this thing is really cool, though. It's actually kind of flexible as well, a little bit. Well, at least when I was taking the other one apart, it kind of was. I didn't realize it wouldn't come apart because it had two screws in it. I know most of the old micro machines only had one. These have two. They roll pretty well, too. Like, they take off like rockets. Look at this little guy. Let's watch him go. Watch him go. Whoa, look at him. Oh, he hit the bump. I was trying to get him to do that in the other video. He actually did it in this video. Awesome. There we go. And now let's look at the Harvester. The Harvester is really cool. I remember when I saw this one at the Toy Fair, I was really excited to find this one when it came out. I'm glad this is, like, one of the first ones that came out. You can remove this if you want to for some reason, and it will go back on. It's not broken. Just be very careful. Just kind of tilt it a little bit forward, and yeah, you can see it's kind of trying to right now. I don't want to pull it off this one. This is my good one. The other one I'd pull it off. It's not that it hurts it or anything. I don't think it's just this one's my perfect one. Out of all the sets in the store, this one had the best paint work and everything. These cars did. But yeah, this thing's really cool. Really cool. It almost looks like you could cut it off, like right here, and you could kind of have it be a four-wheeled one. Which, I'm glad, though, they took the six-wheeled approach. This thing looks really cool. It's six wheels. Like, really cool. It's even got headlight details. Look at all that detail on there. Look at that. That is so nice. That is so nice. Then in the back, we got, um, not really much. Just, like, a vent. I thought maybe this would move, but it doesn't. I've tried moving it a bunch. It doesn't move. I thought maybe this thing right here would move, but it doesn't. Be cool if it did, but it's okay. At least this moves. That's pretty cool. So that means if they ever come out with like a different version of this, um, if for whatever reason you wanted to, um, you could paint it. Uh, well, unless it's the same color. If it's the same color, you could just switch the front end if it if it's the same model and you could probably put a different um harvester piece on the front of this like maybe eventually they'll make one's got a little roller on the front of it i don't know but if they did um and it was a different color you could find the exact color of this one and paint it the exact color and it would work pretty well and you could put a different um harvester piece on the front of this guy this guy also rolls pretty good i was actually surprised about this one i didn't think this one would roll very good but he does look at him go He's pretty fast. Right, let's see them all roll before I end this. Let's see, it's a truck. Whoa! Oh, he did a burnout. That was pretty sweet. All right, let's see the tractor. The tractor, in my opinion, is the best roller in the farm pack. Tractor is a really good roller. Go tractor, go! Oh, look at that. He just kept on going. But yeah, these things are really good rollers. They roll really, really well. <laughs> He just plowed into the back of the farm truck. But, yeah, guys. um, 
really awesome. I highly recommend if you find these, you pick them up. Uh, they're at Walmart. Um, the set they seem to have the least of is uh, the farm set. Uh, they have a lot of the muscle car set from what I've seen, but they have the least of the farm set. And you're lucky if you find the race, uh, the race set because I, the race team set, because I couldn't even find it. I had to order one off eBay. I'm going to go out today and see if I can find a couple more of them because I want to have three of each one. I only wanted two, but I ended up buying one the day I found them on accident and the guy didn't refund me. It's all right. It's my bad. But, um. Yeah, so I got three of each one of these. I probably will make some customs. I'm thinking about making one that looks like a John Deere of these, of this one, and this one here. So I might do that, and I might make a red uh, version of this pickup truck and see if I can remove that off the back of it, that wood part. I don't know if that's possible or not. It's probably not, but I'll see. I'm not going to break it. If it's not, if it doesn't, like, snap off, I'm not going to cut it off or anything like that. So, yeah. These are really cool. I highly recommend. Um, if you see them, you pick them up. We should really support the new micro machines. I know a lot of people don't like them, but I hope they stay around for a while. And if we give them a chance, they might actually get licensing and uh, make real cars. So give these little guys a chance. I think they can go pretty far. All right, that's it for the farm set. And uh, I'll be back with the, I think, race team set. I think once I get it, so... I'm going to do these videos in order. So if I already have number two, I'll be back with that. So thanks guys for watching. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And before I go, I will show you guys the numbers on the bottom of these. So first we got the tractor is number 14. Let me get it to focus here. Come on. I don't know if I can get it to do it, guys. I did it in the other video, but the tractor... Is number 14. There you go. Number 14. This one is number 15. Yep, you see it. 15. And this one is number 16. Now, I like that they did this because it can help keep track of if you're missing a car. Maybe there's a car you don't even know about and you're missing it. Yep, 16. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. I will be back with the next collection very soon. Bye guys.